Okay, it's been printing for eight hours. It just completed. These are the Predator Action Pliers. Let's see if we can get them off the build plate. Kind of stuck down here in the middle. gentle with it. There we go. Now let's see if it actually works or if it's frozen up. Well, cool. It actually does work. A little scrap of something that came from somewhere, but other than that, it's like a good print. Will it actually pick something up? This is Predator Action Pliers, the original version, downloaded from Thingiverse. I will link the thing here, uh, so you can download it and print one too if you like it. Um, I think this has no practical use, I just printed it because it looked cool. Um, and because I'm really fascinated by these print-in-place models where all of the gears and everything are printed in place you know, with the appropriate void spaces so that nothing is uh, locked up. Uh, this is printed in Amazon Basics PETG uh, using 0.2 millimeter layer height, 20% infill, and uh, I'm really pleased with it. It printed nicely. Okay, here is a zoomed in view. You can see the action of the mechanism. Flip it over and take a look at the back side. So there you have the Predator Action Pliers. Let me show the octolapse of it building on the Prusa i3 Mark III printer. I hope you enjoyed this video. If this sort of thing interests you, then please subscribe and I will make more of them. Thank you.